has one of the worst fighting styles throughout the whole series like who the hell agreed to this shit they really couldn't think of anything unique different for this cop character but no no let's just let's just make him like an ultra parry where they parry and then they they could just easily do he actions like that that is some baby formula shit well at least it's a thousand times better than what they did with shinada now now that's shit. Now I know many would defend that he is interesting and if he truly is interesting like you're saying, why was he only in one game? RGG clearly saw there was no bright future for this character and he was just pretty lame and kind of boring. All he had was, oh my father died, now I must find the truth. And he was kind of a dickhead and but that really doesn't make him interesting so El Bozo. Did you know this guy owns a gun? You know how many fights he could have ended by just using his gun? But thinking of it now, it might have been filled with rubber bullets. Again, these motherfuckers are trying to ruin my immersion in these games. Cut it out. And for those who don't get it, play Yakuza 4. Firstly, I thought this was a joke when the when it started, but but no, 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 no. You have to fight like 10 military guys while also getting shot at by the main guy you have to beat. Luckily, Tanamura's baby dick fighting style helps you win, but still like, I do not believe this small man will win this fight realistically. Like, this shit's stupid. Tanamora sucks. Why wasn't he an in infinite wealth?